Today we're back for more Clockwork Tales of Glass and Ink. What did we do? Where are we? What are we up to? Well, we're in the middle of the area here. We're about to go into the factory. And this is super creepy. Ooh, what's this over here? It's a bug. Alright, well, how many bugs do we have here? Okay, 5 of 11, so I guess we have almost reached halfway of the bug situation. So we have some sort of hand thing we're going to have to take care of. A spring-loaded arm assembly guide. Gather a chassis, a spring, and puzzle parts. Alrighty then. Ooh, what's this? Here's our last bit, our golden part. The spring got locked inside the chest. Not sure how we're supposed to open it, but we'll figure that out eventually. Diamond blade! I can cook glass like butter. Okay. Let's look at our map here. So it says we're supposed to go back to the... Oh, we're supposed to do something in the factory. Let's keep on looking here. Uh, I guess we put the hand here? There we go. In the bits. Uh, spring little arm without a spring is just a very heavy glove. Oh, that's just clever. How the hell am I supposed to get the spring out of here? Don't do. Oh, low torch, of course. Now we're ready to roll here with our arm. Fit all the elements into the slot in the mechanical hand. Ooh. Nifty. Alright, so that's clearly not going to work. Uh, hmm, can I rotate? I don't know if I can rotate or not. Put that there. So something has to go in there. Hmm. It's got to be this one. It has to be. But that doesn't make any sense, because how is that going to work over there? Good question. Oh, you know what? It's gotta be this one then. No, but the, I don't have anything flat. I can't rotate it, right? Nope. Alright, then. <laughs> it has to be this one then. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Now we're in business. Now we got this rocking and rolling. Beautiful. Mechanical hand. Five seven two. All right, let's go get our friend out of his captivity. Put her hand against the door. Boom. Oh, another puzzle. Oh, wow. Move the tokens of the same color to the proper rows. You can only move them in an empty space. Uh. Okay, so blue's gotta be here. Red's up there. Uh. Let's see if we can figure this out. Red's gotta go up there. Green is there. Ooh, look at this go. Oh, wow. We only have one more to go. Hmm. This is where I take my butter knife and I pick out the blue one and I stick it in here. Just like a Rubik's Cube. Okay, so how the hell am I supposed to get this out of here? Ooh. Uh, I don't know. Get this out of here. Red's got to get up there. We're still back to this again. Really, game? Like, what the hell? No, let's try this. Oh, I thought it was how I actually had it. Oh my god, what the hell's wrong with me? Uh. Uh, I need 
to switch these around again. Red needs to go there. Oh, we got it. We got it. Boom. There's our puzzle done. So, Excel. Ah, splendid. You've done it, my dear. Alas, we're not out of the woods yet. Barber must be stopped. Sadly, I didn't really figure out how the trimmer machine works. You found some documents regarding the machine. May I see them? Sure. Uh, here you go, blueprints. Hmm. It seems that machine was invented by Barber's father. And he built it to prevent earthquakes, not induce them. Interesting. If we could compare these blueprints with Barber's documents, we might just have a way to stop him. We'll also need a piece of chalk. <sighs> That's random. We'll need a random piece of chalk, please. We need to compare the old blueprints with Barber's documents. Alright, what do we have here? Ooh, a bug. It's too short to be useful. Okay. Looks like we need... Our chalk is going to be for this exercise. Okay. I can uh, totally live with that. Ooh. Curtain. So... Is that to pull that down? No? Flag? No. No such luck. Okay, what does our map say we have to do? We have to go back to the factory. Ooh, hook. Okay. What are we hooking? I don't know. I want to say we want to hook this, but... No. No such luck. Oh. Oh, okay. Boom! Now we have a grappling hook. Fantastic. I think I know exactly where I want to use that. Over here, right? There we go. Up to the office we go. Ooh, and there's a nice little buggy there. Oh, oh, there's our poor friend that's been smashed to smithereens. Or maybe that's his buddy. Uh, ink is wet. Okay. If I replace the glass tube, I could make a capsule. Sure, I could. Ooh. I guess this is not just a decoration, but something is missing. Gears, it looks like. Okay, let's do it. And then hit an object scene here. I do love the steampunk feel of this game. It is fabulous. Extremely well done. Record over there. It's a nice light bulb that we need. A little mini robot and a little mini zeppelin. That's actually quite adorable. A book and a light bulb. Okay, so we need a bunch of books and light bulbs, do we? The heck are the books? Uh, a sketch. There we go. And that was our pocket watch. So we need 12, yes, there. Uh, where? Oh, there's a book. And we need one more book. We're just going to go ahead and hit that last book. There we go. Fabulous. Camera. Okay, that's not what I expected. Ooh, Ooh what are we here? A spyglass. <laughs> what in the world are we up to now? Oh, it looks like we got tons of stuff to do too. Oh, we could probably spy on him. Maybe. No. Camera. Spyglass. Yeah. 
Finally, we've got the machine schematics. Yay! Coming together nicely. Store up. Not sure what we're gonna be doing in here. Oh. Oh, magnet for sure. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Mechanical fish. Factory. Uh. I'm not sure what we're gonna be cutting here. Oh, the glass. Okay. Oh, that's gonna be for glass tube. Yeah. Back to the office. Put that in there, put that on top. Oh. Send an empty capsule. I'm not sure what we're putting in there. Okay, so we'll back out in here for now. Here's the That's drawing it. there, dude. Now we can plan a proper sabotage. To the blackboard. To the blackboard? I can't solve it in my head, a piece of chalk. We need the chalk though. Where the heck's the chalk? Uh, where is it? No. Just my luck. Here, Barbara intended to order a new memory module. It just needs a stand. Okay. How the hell does that help me? Oh, there's the chalk there. Got it. Chalk it up. Start at any point and then connect the points to cover all the lines at once. Huh. Okay, let's see if we can do this here. Usually there's a certain amount of symmetry here. Shoot, and we're screwed. Alright, let's try that again. Let's go here. Let me try the outer areas first. Then we'll try... Whew, here. First. Yeah, and we're not going to do that. Okay, wipe that all down again. Tricky, tricky. Let's do the middle first. Now we need to do. Gonna suck royally. We're not gonna be able to do it. Oh, we're so close. We're so very close. Let's go through the middle here first. Uh, we're not. It's not gonna work. either. Crap. Ha! <laughs> Alright, let's go back in just a split second. Okay, here we go. Let's begin here. Okay. Now we'll go down to here. Clear out the area as best we can. Try to take it out in sections if we can get that to work. So that's going to clear out pretty much the top half. Okay, 
So then from here we should be able to take care of the bottom half. And we're just gonna go there. Oh yeah, and we're good to go. Perfect. Bam. You've solved the equation. It's so obvious now. The only thing standing between us and the machine is Barber himself. A mechanical myriapod. We could use it to lure Barber out. Let's go. All right, we're going to definitely lure him out. In just a moment. Oh, hello there, buddy. I want to go back here for a second. No, I guess not. Wasn't sure if we were going to be able to spy on him. Hello. I can fix it, but it needs a memory module and a tail. Can we use a fish tail? Is that even possible? I don't know if that's possible. Ooh, hidden object scene. Let's go. Oh, we're going to be building a tail, apparently. Cool. Like it already. That tail built up really well. Oh, I haven't used Matthew in ages. I feel like he should be used more often. You know, to reach up the... to get these high bits, you know? Okay, so that's that done. That one done. So we have a leg-ish thing, and that there and we'll go ahead and hit the last one. Beautiful. Alright, there's our tail. So we can go ahead and give that back to our dude. Or not. Ink's pen. That's interesting. Here's your tail, dude. I attached the tail, but we still need a memory module. Not sure what the pen is supposed to do. Oh, okay, we'll put some ink in there. Stamp that up. Put that in there. Put it on there. And go. Yeah, there's a memory module. Here, put that there. I attached the tape. We should reprogram its brain first. Otherwise, it'll rat on us. Okay, I guess that's what this is for, is it? Oh, no, maybe not. Alright, never mind. Let's go to the hidden object scene. Ooh, cool. I got to do a little mini man. Electric spark. What the hell is this supposed to do? I don't know. Oh, get it. There we go. Pencil. Write the formula down. There we go. Red liquid. QL. Top hat. Telephone is the last item on the list. Okay, bird indeed. Not what I was expecting. Bird. Shark. And our friend there. Switch the panels to some of the gears and then collect them. Well, I think we'll take a break here and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.